That looked bad. Are you alright? Let me know you're alright. Bad luck today. That must be incredibly disappointing. Who would you say is your biggest rival at the moment? You won't be starting at the front of the pack. Are you worried? There's quite a buzz around this team at the moment. Appreciate your time. Welcome along then to the North Sea coast and Zandvoort, 25 miles away from Amsterdam and the host for today's Dutch Grand Prix. It's a race the great Jim Clark won on four occasions, leading for an astonishing total of 370 laps. A lap of this short 2.6 mile Zandvoort circuit features 14 corners, 10 to the right and four to the left. The main straight is 678 meters long and heads into turn one, the Tarzan corner. With DRS down the main straight into the braking zone, that could be the best overtaking opportunity on the track. Joining me for today's race once again is Anthony Davidson. Let's talk about more. They're in for a tough race today. They'll be starting out of position due to a penalty from earlier in the weekend. Yes, it's not the position you want to be in at the start of the Grand Prix. Penalties like this put you in amongst the traffic. But we know they have more pace than those around them, so I expect they'll make some strong progress in the first few laps. Before we begin, let's take a quick look at the grid lineup for today's race. Max Verstappen put in a fantastic lap yesterday and he starts from pole position. Edging out Lando Norris, who'll start from P2. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Leclerc, Sainz, Valtteri Bottas and Perez, Ricardo, Stroll, Russell and Sebastian Vettel, Ocon, Matsushita, Antonio Giovinazzi and Joe, Sonoda, Gasly, Nicholas Latifi and Mick Schumacher, Mazepin and more. Which of these talented drivers will come out on top today? Points finished last race, let's aim to keep the momentum going.
That's the end of the race. We'll see you in Park Fermi. Many doubted whether they could pull off the win here in Zandvoort, but they have done, and done it in spectacular style. Anthony Davidson, what helped them deliver this result, do you think? Well, they certainly stood out as a driver with tons of confidence on the track. I think their ability to keep their cool, even during some of the more hectic parts of the race, meant they were able to capitalise on the mistakes of other drivers, giving them the opportunity to make their way to the top spot with ease. The drivers are en route to the podium as we speak. What a fantastic win for the Red Bull team. They performed exceptionally today, keeping us firmly on the edge of our seats throughout the entirety of the race. Congratulations to every one of the team. Driver standings. That lead at the top of the table has shrunk somewhat today. Some amazing talent out on the track today. But Anthony, who would you pick as your driver of the day? I'll probably go for Pierre Gasly. The team did a good job with the strategy to put him in amongst the pack, but it's the driver's job to capitalise on those opportunities, and he did so with a lot of skill. It's time to see how things are shaping up in the Constructors' Championship. Red Bull pull further ahead in the standings. Meanwhile, good work from Aston Martin this weekend, who pushed themselves further up the order. After an event like that, who knows what the sport has in store for us next time. Be sure to join us again as we continue to bring you the latest excitement in Formula One.